balls in the dressing room, you know exactly what I expect. Listen to me at all times, keep yourself protected. When I say stop, you stop. If you want to touch, now's the time. God bless. The legendary return of John Jones took place. He went to fight for the vacant heavyweight belt against Cyril Gain, where he was able to finish the Frenchman in the first round. Thereby, he became the first number of pandas for pound. But he is not going to relax. Jones has already challenged Steep Miosic to fight. Hello fighters, the MMA Predictions channel is with you. In this video, I will give a prediction for the expected fight for one of the greatest fights in history, John Jones vs. Steep Miosic. But before starting this video, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and like it so that as many fans around the world as possible can see this video. Let's start in order. As we know, John Jones held the light heavyweight title for a long time, but eventually disappeared from the radar due to an unclean doping test. We hadn't heard from him for a long time, but he came back in his second fight against Alexander Gustafsson, where he was able to defeat him ahead of schedule by winning the light heavyweight belt again. After that, he was able to defend his title three times, but the last two defenses were not to say that they were dominant. And as a result, Jones realized what the problem was. He no longer felt the same hunger as before during the period when he fought with Machida, Jackson, and many veterans of this sport and he decided to rise to a higher category. But in order not to be inferior in size, he will have to take a break and build muscle volume. And thus we have not seen Jones for three years, but he could have returned much earlier. But disagreements with the UFC about money, negotiations with Francis Ngannou, did not give him such an opportunity and he returned only three years later. Initially, everyone assumed that Ngannou would become Jones' first opponent in heavyweights, but he did not accept the policy of the main promotion and successfully broke the contract with them. And thus John Jones and Cyril Gain met against each other on the eve of their fight, or rather, a week passed as usual a photo set of fighters where you could evaluate their form but after John's pictures were leaked, all mixed martial arts fans began to unanimously trumpet that Gan would destroy John. But after a short time a photo appeared from a different angle where Jones looked healthier and more pumped up than in the first photos, but everything was smooth. Everyone expected to see John in the guise of Francis, and he, to put it mildly, did not live up to the expectations of his fans. But in the fight, he surprised his fans in a good sense of the word. He was able to make Gan knock in the first round and become the new heavyweight champion. And after that, he challenged Stipe to battle, who accepted this fight, and in the summer this truly legendary battle awaits us, and therefore I will not torment you and right now, we are starting to analyze this confrontation. <laughs> Percussive style. Well, let's start with the John Jones punch. It will be difficult to assess his past fight, but if you analyze each episode in detail, you can identify several tricks from Jones. The first thing I noticed about Jones is that he still has his stomp kicks. In some episodes, you can see how he punches them. Also, his pressure remained at the same level. In addition to everything else, he used the well-known wrestling trick when he grabbed Gan by the leg and then abruptly transferred the attack to the top. In general, M. Jones for such a short fight demonstrated that he can still perform at a high level. Of the minuses that I noticed was his speed, or rather its absence. As expected, Cyril was faster than the American, and so it happened. In some moments, Jones could not keep up with the younger Frenchman. Now let's move on to Steepy's striking technique. The last time he fought was back in 2021, where he lost to Nganu by a terrible knockout. In that fight, the Cameroonian and dismantled the champion into Adams. In the last fight, Steepy did not show and did not give competition from the word at all. Apparently, it was not underestimation that played, since Miasek usually caused serious problems on his hands. 
Just remember his two fights against DC, in which he competently worked with Cormier and did not allow him to use his strengths. Also, if you look into the past, then he also played the first fight against Nganu perfectly, first tiring Francis in the fight and then interrupting him in his arms for the rest of the time. And even more so, such a break will clearly benefit the Croat, since lately he has missed too much and it all came back to haunt him in the fight against Nganu. But a sufficient amount of time has passed since this fight. Miasic's head has fully recovered and is ready for battle. If I choose the favorite it objectively, then I will believe more in Steepy, since he showed us what he can do just to interrupt the top weights in the rack, and we didn't see Jones for a long time in the rack, and we can't say that he interrupted Cyril. <laughs> Now let's move on to the wrestling base and this time we'll start with Steep, who doesn't really like to use it or use it at all. In my memory, he used wrestling only once. This is in a duel against Francis and Ganu. Then the young Cameroonian did not know what wrestling was at all. That's it. This is the only fight where we saw all the beauty of the Croats struggle and in the rest of the fights his priority melted on the striking technique. In the second fight against Cormier, DC did not start badly. He translated and controlled the former champion for a whole round. If the American had continued in the same vein, perhaps he would have won that fight. Also in the last fight, Francis and Ganu managed to translate him. The basic drummer, yes, yes, you understood everything correctly. That is, the person whom he previously translated and controlled. Now he destroys you in the fight. I don't know how to explain it. Then we move on to Jones, where I have something to say. On the eve of the fight with Gunn, there was a big question whether John would have enough power to compete in the fight against the natural heavyweight, since in the last fight a less experienced fighter easily avoided the Americans' translations, and it turned out that he had enough strength, he easily went behind his back, and then lowered his opponent to the bottom with a sweep, and then finished after a while. At that moment I was shocked, to put it mildly, since Jones, as we know, comes from the light heavyweight division, who did not always manage to transfer fighters from his weight category, and here he easily controls the weights, it really deserves respect. John will naturally be considered the favorite, without any doubt he will transfer Steep, and for him everything can end within two rounds, given what kind of defense he has. <laughs> spirit. Now let's talk about John's stamina, and so he did not give such an answer about his gas tank, since the fight ended in the first round and now, I can't sensibly assess his reserve. I'm just guessing that because of the weight he's gained, he might start having problems closer to the championship rounds, but I'll say it again, it's just my guess, since we haven't seen John with that weight in the 3.4 and 5th rounds. As for Steep, he has always passed such a distance without any problems. Problems. For him 25 minutes has become a habit, so I have no complaints about the Croatian about endurance, of course he will be considered favorites, but in terms of spirit, I will choose John, since you yourself saw he is now charged more than ever, that hunger woke up in him, which has been in it since the 2013 era. <laughs> Forecast. In this fight, I will choose John Jones as the winner. I think from the very beginning he will transfer Steep and will try with all his might to finish him. Elbows, ground and pound, sob machine, he will use everything. And as I think within two rounds the fight will be stopped. <laughs> of fighters. John, after defending the title, will continue to perform and confidently defend the belt, in my opinion. 
He will even defeat Pavlovich just the same with the help of wrestling. As for Steep, he will understand that his career has come to a logical end, and he will no longer have a chance to return the belt.